Hi there, this is Fixed It. In a previous video, I showed you how to sort out a problem with an iPad mini, an iPad or an iPhone that has greyed out Wi-Fi and with Wi-Fi not working. And I showed you using a hub and a couple of connectors that you could actually run it on the LAN. Well, I've been investigating this further. And the device I've come across is this device here. It's the CSL USB 3 hub, 3 port and LAN. It's a really nice bit of kit. Plug your computer, your iPhone or iPad into this, and then you plug your LAN network into this end and it will give you LAN on your iPad. Ah, you can't. What you need to get this to work is a Lightning to USB connector if you're using a Lightning device. And basically what you do is you plug your Lightning device into the port at the bottom, and then you plug this device into that. Now one of the first things you'll notice is a light come up on this and no warning has come up on the iPad. One of the things that happens whenever you plug things into iPads that require any sort of power is that the iPad immediately screams this is an incompatible device or it needs too much power. This hasn't asked that. So what that means is I should be able to connect to a local area network with an ethernet cable without having to have a powered USB hub. So I've got a cable here and I will now plug that into there. And now I should have a LAN ethernet on my iPad mini. And remember, this was an iPad mini that had no Wi-Fi. It's telling me to turn airplane mode off. Well, I turned airplane mode on to make sure that it wasn't using the GSM and it couldn't try and use the broken Wi-Fi. Uh, so I just say OK. And now you wait. And what's going to happen is it's going to come back and it's going to start using the LAN, which is connected to my router by this cable. And I'm just waiting for that to happen. And there we have it. I've clicked on updates. It's telling me that these were the things that were updated recently. I'll go to purchased. And as you can see, it's all coming through automatically. Uh, so if I go out of that now and I go into Safari and I was just looking at something at John Lewis and it's telling me, hey, by the way, your airplane's on. I can't use it. I've got no Ethernet connection. But in fact, it's not the case. And, and so now, as I click on things, it just changes as I go along. And I'll just pick something else just to show you. Okay, thank you very much. And go to gaming. And there. And it's loading the page. So that's it. This was an iPad mini that had no Wi-Fi and no real way of connecting it to the internet except for through iTunes, which is slow. And what I've done is I've used a lightning to USB connector and then this USB 3 to Ethernet connector. And it gives me these extra ports to plug into the uh, um, iPad. And now it's working absolutely perfectly. So no need to carry any power tub or anything. These devices will allow you onto the internet. I'm going to do some more testing on this. And and when I do, I think we'll find some very interesting results. I hope you like the video. If you have an iPhone, an iPad that's got greyed out Wi-Fi and won't connect to the internet, this is a great, great workaround. Hope you like the video. Thanks for watching. Bye.